metering in action and how you can use resource metering to gather statistics of a virtual machine. On this Hyper-V system, I have a virtual machine that I want to collect usage statistics to see what types of resources this virtual machine is using. So let me pull open a script I have here that allows me to um, first enable resource metering and I'll copy that information here and then for the virtual machines running on this host I've turned on resource metering the next thing I want to do is measure the statistics for this particular virtual machine so I'll run that select query and what this tells me is that I have some average CPU utilization, average RAM, uh, total disk trans uh, utilization, network in inbound and outbound traffic. Next, I want to capture the way of trying to figure out how do I cost this environment. Um, for how much memory usage do I charge a certain number of dollars for just the fact that the virtual machine exists? So I've created a little function here to calculate the VM cost, and I'll run that right now against that information that I just retrieved. And then lastly, I can now see how much I should charge or show back to the user that virtual machine's been using. And then after I've done that for this month, I'll want to reset my data. So I'll calculate the cost. And then I'll, after I've calculated the cost and passed that off to the customer, I can now resource, reset the data to start collecting that data again for the next month and then the next time I can calculate that cost again. So what this allows me to do is see, one, how much of the resources an organization or a person or a particular VM is using or a resource pool is using. I can then use that to help with either showback or chargeback against that resource group or pool or that virtual machine and I can then reset that environment to start collecting data again for, say, the next month. So now we've shown you what types of things you can do to, and what types of things Windows Server 2012 and Hyper-V have brought to allow you to manage your multi-tenant environments through network virtualization, through resource metering, through PVLAN support and all the other capabilities uh, we've added within Windows Server 2012 and Hyper-V to provide a secure, isolated, multi-tenant environment.